Okay. Let's take a look at this one. Which of these two waves do you think represents a particle with a higher moment momentum? Assume the two particles have the same mass. Which particle would have a higher momentum? The one that has this wave right here or the one, the particle that's associated with this wave? The other one. Which? Uh, so let's call this A and let's call th this one B. B has higher momentum. Why? P is H over lambda, right? So which one has a larger lambda? A has a bigger lambda, right? That's your lambda for A. And lambda for B is this one. So you say lambda A is larger than lambda B. So bigger denominator means smaller momentum. So you say the momentum for particle A is going to be less than momentum for particle B. Actually, they don't even have to have the same mass. Okay. All right, so uh, we say then that a shorter wavelength is associated with a higher momentum. We say momentum and wavelength are inversely proportional. 